Hello, everybody. It's Ray of Supergirl. Season 3, Episode 9, the finale! Well, the mid-season finale. Spoilers, if you have not watched this episode. Samantha does not remember where she's at. She's at her home, and like, what? What did I do? Where did I go? And she's having a good time. She's like, I'm gonna make you pancakes! I'm like, oh my gosh, she's being a good mother to Ruby! And then now it's the Christmas season. Yep, they're having a good Christmas party, and it was awkward because you could feel awkward because before that, uh, Kara asked, well, no, you guys can come too. They don't go because they know the awkwardness is still there, okay? But they have a party, and it's pretty cool. I'm like, oh, shit, that's my jam. Yeah. And then John and Wynn are fighting over the best Christmas song. And they're like, deck the halls. And I forgot what they were talking about. Something about a sequel. And his dad, John's dad, is like, ooh, this amazing black drink. It's called coffee. Oh, amazing. Oh, and then they're fighting over Star Wars. And, and, you know, New Hope and Empire. They're like, oh my god, sequels are always better. And he's like, uh, what's a sequel? I was like, you gotta get them caught up. <laughs> the next Supergirl's flying around the city. Rain. The symbol of rain is showing up. And they're like, what the hell? It's showing up everywhere. And then she gets a call from Kovalt, the cult leader. Yeah, and she's like, okay. And he's telling her everything. It's all cryptic. That she will come in threes. She will make her sign. She will have blood spill. And then she will come there to defeat you in front of everybody. I'm like, whoa. And he thinks she's crazy. And then next thing you know, Samantha. Oh, and something's going on with Lana and Gemma. You can feel the chemistry this whole season. And I'm for it. I approve. Okay. It does, this one does not seem like... It did not seem forced. It was good. I liked it. So yeah, she's getting saved by him, and then the thing, she got hit by something, and then she's like, who the hell's trying to kill me? They go to Morgan, and Morgan has nothing to do with it. So next thing you know, uh, Samantha goes there, and then they were talking about, and then they, she sees Morgan, and like, she's, yeah, Rain went to the office party to get him, I'm like, that was an awkward thing. And then the thing is, uh, he survives, because she can't, he can't, she can't see over. She can't see through lead either. So that was crazy. And then he was like, mate, I don't know if it's Supergirl. I cannot confirm he would mention her name. So next, she attacks a gang. <laughs> she slaughtered all of them. Because it's on the news. And then next thing you know, she, and then Supergirl's like, I got this. <sighs> she did her symbol. And then they fight in the day of night. National City. Okay, literally, this feels like Doomsday versus Superman in 1992. Yeah, if the comic book. Well, the thing is, but a couple people were trying to speculate that it was going to be high. Nah, after when the movie came out, like, whoo, prices went down. The only one I think that costs as money is the Platinum Edition. I don't know if it costs that much. Like, if it's sealed, I think maybe like 75 Yeah, the regular versions, no, I, phew, maybe like, I, I wouldn't want to. I probably would probably get a couple copies because just because they're age and maybe they'll go in value a couple years. Uh, probably like shoot, I don't know. I'll probably get the black and the and the white when it returns. I'll probably get those ones, but we'll see. The f so they're fighting. Ding ding ding! Rain versus Supergirl. They're fighting all over National City. It is crazy. The fight is amazing. Like boom boom. And the next they take the fight to another venue. A Christmas office party. They're like, J jingle bell, jingle bell. I'm like, wow. <laughs> like, this is one office party. They won't forget that the ice sculpture's broken. The food's all over the floor. <laughs> it's crazy ass. So they're fighting and fighting and fighting and boom! She gets her ass. She gets her butt. She gets her ass whooped. She's getting beat up. It is crazy. I'm like, oh my god. La, la, my god. Everyone sees her get defeated. Like, she's heating, and then she grabs her right there, and the next thing you know, she just lets her go, and boom. And then, boom, she's straight to the infirmary of the DEO. Everyone's like, oh my, they can't believe it, she lost. And that's how they ended this episode. She got, she's been defeated, she's not dead. She's been very, very hurt. She's hurt, yeah. Whew, ouch. Anyway, please come and subscribe and take care.